Where are we going? <gasps> Santa Luna Forest is ahead. Well, be thankful I took all of your money before the forest, child. Wait up, let's walk together. I feel like something exciting will happen if I stay by you. I'll heal your Pokemon whenever you want me to. Oh, all right. Well, that's cool. Should I keep training my Pidgey? He's in the first slot, right? Yeah, Chimkin. Eh, why not? I do like Pidgeot. And now that I say that, I think that I did have a Pidgeot as my flying type when the last time I played this game. So I probably will switch him up. Maybe add a Braviary. Braviary is pretty cool. He's just America the Pokemon. This is Santa Luna Forest. Keep an eye out for dropped items. Oh, thank you. I will do just that. And as you can see, this game is very reminiscent of of Red and Blue, and that was on purpose for sure, with it being like the first full 3D title. So before this, you had, starting with Diamond and Pearl, you kind of had like 2D, 3D stuff. Are you a trainer? No. So it leads to a dead end, huh? All right, I guess I'll save my progress so I don't forget what I've done so far. That's actually a really good idea. Ret saved. Yeah, I can use save states because I'm using Citra, but you never know with stuff like that. I'll probably use both. For the potion, there are lots of dropped items in here. Find all the dropped items. Oh my god, a kidder pee. You're good, Chimkin. Oh, he's level two. I was gonna say I was gonna I was gonna get him for the Pokedex to do it for the decks, but he's level two. I feel like I'll absolutely at least run into something a little bit higher level than that. A Caterpie, anyway. Kill him. Take his lunch money for that 11 experience that Chimkin just got. It's over here. The music in this area is cool. The music in this game is really cool. And as far as like the frame drops and other people's things saying with how this game's compatibility with Citra is, it hasn't been bad so far. Like that frame drop there from the battle starting was the worst I've seen it. And uh, yeah, this game, I mean, it runs at only runs at 30 FPS anyway. It might have some weird texture glitches with the emulation, which just is a thing that happens with a lot of games, but. So far, I haven't seen any. It says there's some audio glitches, but I think it's just like, sometimes the music pops. Hey, a Fletchling. I may have tried Fletchling as my flying type, but switched him out because I had so many fire types in my party. Is this, if I remember correctly, this game like just really wants to load you up on fire types. That reduced my attack. All right, you might survive another tackle then, which would actually be good because then I could catch you. Yeah, cool. Okay, there's some strategy. Ow. I can't remember which Pokemon game started the trend or the mechanic of still getting experience while catching Pokemon, because that, thank God. Whoever had that idea, thank you. Mine. I caught you, Fletching. And my Chimkin is level 6. You never kill him. He's too powerful. These friendly Pokemon send signals to one another with beautiful chirps and tail feather movements. Oh, so cute. It actually is really cute. No nickname yet. I don't think I'll keep him. Whoa! Oh my god, it's another- see, it's another fire type. It's like this game is full of fire types. Also, I think back in the day when I played this game, I- I played Y. Because I- I thought that the, uh, the legendary on the box art was cooler. And he is. He's like the bird instead of the deer. He's pretty cool. Um, I think he'll survive another hit. Or he could just get killed, but... Uh, I'll find another one. This... I think it's black and white that gives you these three elemental monkeys. They really push them on you. Like, early. And you end up using them, and it's like, uh, I don't like having, like, the three elemental monkeys in my team. It's annoying. Oh, are they really getting into a battle? 
I, I, I kind of wanted to battle this person. That was cool. I'm sure the first time someone saw that, they were like, Oh my god. He just got into a battle on the map. A scatterbug. Oh my god. i have consistently blown away by everything in the game. Oh my god, a scatterbug, go Chimkin. This will probably get Chimkin to level 7. I'll switch back out. For, uh, Froki. Come on, Chimkin. Hell yeah. Alright, time to switch. Can you heal me, actually? That'd be good. Just in case. Okay, here's a, here's a kid to mess up. What? Oh, hang on one second. What are you doing? Look what I found. I'll give it to you. I love puzzles, so I watch everything more closely than you might think. A paralyzed seal. Ooh, you found it on the ground. Thanks for giving me garbage you picked up. Hello, child. Come on, scatterbug. Let's powder this punk. Not wise to announce your move, child. And he's only level three. What are you guys even doing in this forest? Are you even like bothering to grind? Like a real Pokemon fan would? You make me sick, Scatterbug. Hell yeah, all right. And quick attack? Well, that's a pretty good move to have this early. Fletchling, will you send in your Pokemon? No, I didn't want to. You're weak to me. And you're, again, level three, what a dumb bitch. Have this super effective bubble. All right, kid. You're gonna have to give me your money now. Too bad. Aw, shucks, I don't have any money. $72, that's like not even enough for a potion. I forget how, how little you get at the start for winning Pokemon battles. Items. Come on, be something I don't have. Caterpie, I don't have one yet. I'll probably be level two again. <laughs> yep. Get out of my way, trash. You were never gonna be a Butterfree. You're gonna die in this forest of Caterpie forever. I'll harvest your 11 experience points and move on. All right. Wow, man, this place is a maze. It's less of a maze than Viridian Forest. Do you have any Pokeballs? Yeah, here you go. Oh, she gave me a Pokeball? Everyone's so nice. Sorry for shit talking you. Not, I mean, not, not really, but like, I guess. Hello, your Pokemon are in for a shock. Oh, let me guess, you have a fucking Pikachu, right? I think maybe Pikachu's not in X. Pikachu's definitely in Y. Oh, I mean, like definitely in X for trainer battles, but you might not be able to catch Pikachu in X. I know you can in Y because I have one. Well, hey, just because both of my strongest Pokemon are, are not good against you is... Oh, shit. Good thing I have that Paralyzed Heal. Come on now. Don't be... Don't be priming me for a one-hit kill. Alright, Froki, pull this out. Just don't be paralyzed. Oh, come on. Thank you. I thought the Sparks money was like, he gave up, basically. That was a good amount of experience. Damn.
Eep. I was the one who got shocked. Here's 120 Poké Dollars. You're richer than that kid. Yeah, please heal Froakie's paral paralysis. Oh, man. I stepped on a, on a Weedle. Maybe sh I should grab a Weedle. He's only level 3, though. He doesn't take super long to grind them up, but... Okay, you know what? I'll do it. I'll do it for the decks. Go, Pokeball. Pokeball! Stay in that ball, Weedle. Yes. Weedle's data. He's se Holy fuck, Weedle weighs seven pounds? God damn. All right, I'm a little scared of Weedle, actually. Stepping on him would hurt. You stub your toe on Weedle, dude. Trip over that bitch. Is that a seven pound Weedle in your pocket or are you happy to see me? Oh, I probably shouldn't have used that because I want to catch one of these. Fuck. Well, sorry. I could switch back to Pidgey you now. Hello, prep girl. Once I hit level 10 with Froakie, which probably after this battle, I'll switch to Pidgeot. The best part about Pokemon of the battles is that they can happen anywhere, anytime, anywhere, with anyone watching. In a car, in a pickup truck, in a windowless van down by the river. I love that PS1 texture shading on the ground. That's great. I could. You know, the game looks really jaggy and everything, and I, I could go into the emulation settings and, like, up the internal rev resolution, because I just have it at, like, 240p right now, which is the, the default that the that the 3DS runs on. It's, like, 400p or whatever. So, I could do that, but... Eh. The game already has many frame stutters here and there. I think that would just make it worse. It's really not... Honestly, I, I think the frame stutters that it gets are less noticeable than how bad the frame rate for this game is during battles on the 3 ds Especially if you put it into the 3D mode, it runs at like 15 frames per second. <laughs> it's really bad. I am almost never used it. I, I probably used it more in this game than any other on the 3DS just because like back then it was still a novelty. I bought my 3DS in like 2012-ish. When did the 3DS release? 2010? I actually don't remember. There we go, Froakie's... Ooh, lick! Let's forget... Growl. Bye. The 3DS was released in 2011. I got mine like a year after it came out. I bought it used, I think I got a copy of Mario 3D Land with it, which I love Mario 3D Land. I think I've beaten that game all the way through like three times. I really like that game a lot. I found a Pokeball. A pocket ball, <laughs> kind of. All right, let's switch in Pidgey because I said I would. Since he's three levels below Froakie now, since Froakie is level 10. Yeah, man, I just, I can't believe it's been 10 years to the day that this came out. It's crazy. Rut found a potion. I should say, I really want to play Pikachu. If this is a Pikachu right here, that would be a coincidence or it's scheduled to happen. Scheduled. <laughs> I have this scheduled to happen right now. Alright, Fletchling, get out of here. V 
Wunderbar. I know there is a... P I, 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 I kind of want to look a little bit and see if I can catch a Pikachu. So, you're the first to arrive. This is when I reveal my true form. Looks like my new neighbor is someone with a lot of potential. I was the one to get out first. The way the Pokemon move is just incredible. I want to show off some of that spirit when I dance. I hate Tierno. What a bad character. Tierno, shut up. Do you think about something besides how Pokemon move for once? It's creepy. But I love the way that Zygarde moves. We're all here. Let's go to Santa Loon City. Okay. Suntan Loon City. Satan City? What are y'all going to do? Why, look for Pokemon, of course. The professor did ask us to complete the Pokedex, after all. And furthermore, different Pokemon prefer living in different places. To put it another way, if it's chance to find different Pokemon than the ones in the forest. I'll bet different Pokemon will use different moves. I sure want to see lots of moves. Hey, dude, this guy's head. Look at him right now. What are you going to do, Serena? Die? I'm going to go to uh, to the gym. So I can work on my abs. You sure know a lot. It's because mom and dad taught me so much. Here, I have something for you guys. Adventure rules. Wrote down 10 different tips every trainer should know. Here's one for you. Tip number one. Don't be a bitch. If you're puzzled about something, try looking in these rules. Bye. And she runs off. Rude. I'm going to spend some time getting to know my little Fennekin. What are you going to do, Rhett? I'm going to fucking kill people. All right. I mean, I guess I should tell her. I'm going to spend some time. What are you going to do? We just d we can't answer her. We have to be rude. Well, I'm going to beat up this kid. Just checking. So I have no, fr no more free heals. No more free rides for me. Mommy told me that I should battle anyone who greets me. Fucking bam! Right in the face. Punches stupid freckles. Preschooler? What is a preschooler doing out here at 10.30 at night? Playing with worms. Getting the lunch money beat out of them. That's what. Stupid bitch with your level 2 Caterpie. Azrael. Oh. You've got something rare. Back in my day, we... Oh, okay. Well, I was thinking of Meryl, but I was going to say, Back in my day, we called you Pika Blue. Kids thought you were cool. And also, we thought that you could catch Mew by pushing a truck. Simpler times. Fucking Chimkin's getting buff. You better believe it. You have biceps on those wings. Mommy told me to be polite. You're sixty-four dollars. That was the the money your daddy was supposed to spend on milk. This is this another preschooler? What is like? What's with all these preschoolers out here at nighttime? Is there a gas leak at the school? What did you do last night, Rhett? Oh, I fucking went to the park at 10.30 and beat up a bunch of preschoolers. I always hang out with preschoolers at 10.30 at night. It's way past their bedtime, but that's fine. Their parents don't care. That was it? What a dummy. Basically, that kid just had a taser. Eh, I could use the, the Paralyze Heal, but I really don't need to. Whoa! What an asshole! Did you see that? No regard for other human life. Can't pass because of prickly thorns, but a Pokemon might be able to cut. I think this is the game where you, like, select the Pokemon to ride. It has, like, ride Pokemon. Hey, my Pokemon and I are studying. Want to join us? Are you another preschooler? No. This is a school kid, though. Why are there so many school kids? What did I just walk into? Oh god, it's Bidoof, it's destroyer of worlds. Have a sand attack, Bidoof, since I'm paralyzed and such. Oh, I'm paralyzed and can't move. I still want to do a sand attack here. 
Oh, I'm being attacked by a Bidoof. Well, come on with the paralysis. Fucking Bidoof. Uh, come on. Let me get a sand attack in edgewise here. Well, I'm kind of fucked now. Attack. I avoided the growl because it, my attack is already so low it couldn't do anything. Ooh. Well, I refuse to give up. I have nine potions right now. Aha! No, stop, I said. Stop it! Thank God, okay. Get out of here. At least this kid had a level six Pokemon. I mean, that's... It's kind of respectable for the area we're in. Ancient Kindler and Gust, which is... That was worth it. Wow. Okay, that kid was loaded. She gave me 192 bucks. Well, didn't mean to do that, but a super potion was definitely worth it. I'll be keeping that for a while, probably. Oh my god, we're gonna have to battle this kid. I'm gonna use the paralysis heal, because... There we go. Hello, child. The best way to learn about a move is to have your Pokemon use it. Who are you? To fucking presume I don't know that, Brighton. I bet your mom's never even home when you get off the school bus. I bet you're one of them. That's really mean. I'm sorry. I was one of those, so... Here you go. Have a gust. <laughs> anyway... <clears throat> Pen Sage, Pen And now Pan Seer? He's gonna have all three, isn't he? Oh, actually, I take it back. This kid this is the kind of kid whose mom bought him Pokemon. And she, like, went for the three monkeys. I, I do have to say, I love Pan Seer's facial expression, though. Look at him. He's like, oh, I'm trying my best. This fucking bird's blowing air all over me. I'm too low of a level to even know an elemental attack. Man, pretty soon, Chimkin is going to be the same level as Froki. I'm pretty, pretty excited about that. Chimkin's pretty cool. Aw. Oh. Alright. Pampor's pretty cute. Their evolutions are terrible, though. Man, I'm I'm beating up everyone on this playground here. You see, there there's gotta be a new Pokemon to catch, right? A Dunsparce! It's a meme, everybody. It's level five. Yeah, I'll grab a Dunsparce. I don't know if Dunsparce beyond just being like a meme and having a rollout. Is Dunsparce any good? Stay in there. Oh, no, I will catch you. Don't think that you're going to wipe my whole team right now. Good thing this isn't a Nuzlocke. All right, listen, you. Get in the fucking ball and like it. The more balls I waste on you, the more likely you're stuffed in the PC for all eternity. And you never come out. Think about that. That's right. Alright then. <laughs> I 
Froki just got a lot of experience for doing literally nothing. You like got out and watched. When spotted, this Pokemon escapes backwards by furiously boring its tail into the ground. Uh, furious, furiously boring into the ground with its tail. Jesus, it's getting late. Give a nickname to the Cod Dunspark. So yes, I'll name him lovingly. Uh, um, dumb sparks. Oh, not dumb soul. No. Perfect. Tum Sparse has been transferred to box one. Oh man, they didn't have the, uh, they didn't have the, uh, long pause. They didn't have the quality of life to let you transfer it from a box. I was trying to see how awkward I could make that. Okay. Uh, can I fight this preschooler? No. Went to the Pokemon Center because I was asked to buy balls. Well, don't you go to the Pokemon Mart for balls? Stupid kid. Or is this the game where they combine them? I guess they combine them. Oh, great. This fucking smelly kid I don't want to talk to. Oh, hey there, Red. Are you here to get your Pokemon healed too? Pokemon Center sure are great. You can talk to the lady at the counter and have her heal your Pokemon for free. It's socialism. It's amazing. Oh, just don't ask about the war. Oh yeah, there's a Pokemon in the back of the Pokemon Center. It's a good idea to stock up on Pokeballs and potions and stuff the Pokemon too. I hate Tier now. So much. Hold on, no, I don't want to. I want to. I gotta look at the PC first. Rat booted up the PC. We are going to deposit a piece of shit. Who do we want to deposit? Yeah. Vidal, get out. We do not want you. We don't want Bunnelby either. Bunnelby is kind of a piece of shit. I don't want this asshole. I don't even really want Fletchling, if I'm being honest. I might have to deposit Fledgling, too. I don't think I'm going to use Fledgling. So. We're going to take Dunsparce. And I might level Dunsparce up to be the same level before next episode when you guys come back. But also, I've got to buy some shit. Welcome to the Pokemart. You can buy balls and you can buy potions, but you can't buy both at the same time. That would be bad. All right. Oh, with the, the, the exit. Ugh, that sounded like a fucking dog throwing up. Whoa, the exit menu. Oh, the clothes shop. That's right. Do I talk to you? It's fitting room in the back. You can change in a flash. Uh, does this game have clothes shops or just like changing one thing? Can I change my hat to, I do have multiple, do I? No. Change. Oh, whoa. There's my, like, sexy character model, I guess. Select an item. Oh, okay, there's, so there's, like, multiple now. So we can have the logo t-shirt. That's pretty cool. I like the zip jacket, though. Ooh, skinny jeans instead of skinny jeans, but they're brown. The game won't let me wear a pretty dress because it's not fucking brave enough. <clears throat> Two-tone bag. Okay. And then glasses. Can I can I equip de-equip those? Yeah, there we go. I just don't like the glasses on the hat. I like the regular hat. And I like the other hats so you can get better. In fact, I might actually take the hat off. Because I don't I kinda like it when you can get the, the regular trainer hat. But I don't really like this weird trucker cap. Can I not take the hat off? Take off your shirt. I really can't take off the hat. That's stupid. I guess I'm just used to uh, 
the newer games where you can do all sorts of stuff. All right, there. We don't have the glasses. It looks a little bit better. Uh, the hair looks kind of cool in this hat, I guess. It's not as bad as I thought. All right, I got to save. I'm going to level up Dunsparce to be level 9 or so. And then next time we come back, we'll move on. I think there's a gym in this town. So we'll see what all the hubbub is about. See you then.